going on guys welcome back part two uh we already scaled this uh, load it took me a while it took me like two hours because i was trying to set up my card on the on the way my scale app and it was asking for employee id i was putting in my employee id or employee code and it wasn't working uh, ended up being my social so got that taken care of we scaled um pretty close to weight not really but it feels heavy but on the paperwork it doesn't have any weights or anything like that so i had to scale it just to make sure but we're on our way um we are getting for right now at least good gas mileage um about 10 miles hopefully you know once we get you know a little bit more flat if we ever do because we're going up so uh, it'll go up just a little bit but we're getting about 10 miles to the gallon so we'll see how this plays out i got about a half a tank before i have to stop so i'm probably just gonna drive like five hours or you know six hours and then stop and see where i need to fuel uh, so we're on our way uh, we're about 1800 miles away so like i said it'll be probably like two and a half days uh, three days to get there so we'll probably be there monday if not tuesday early morning see if they'll unload me during that time if not so be it we'll just uh roll it over the next week but uh i'll catch y'all when i make the next stop uh probably be somewhere in louisiana uh if not a little bit after houston so i'll see y'all then So we are in McAllen, Alabama. We drove all day today. 
I'm a little, a little tired, not too much. I'm gonna go inside and get something to eat here at the Loves, and um, I'm not gonna refuel right now. I'm just gonna wait till the morning. In the morning, I'll refuel and uh, get going. We gotta buy 185 miles to go, but I will be doing my planning tonight to get into New Jersey because the tolls are heavy up there. So I'm trying. I want to see if there's any tolls in the way that I need to, you know, avoid. Um, if not. Um, should be good to go because it's a little bit south of uh, Philadelphia, so it's it's not way up there in the north. So uh, I will catch y'all tomorrow. I'm gonna catch the and I'll see y'all there. Hello guys, five in the morning today, Monday, the 17th. Um, went out up and filled up the tank uh, here because it's a lot more expensive up north. So. I did that uh, here. It's $1.70 with the taxes up there. It's like almost $2. So I went and filled up. That way I could be able to get up there and then uh, fuel when I'm coming back down once I get down. But um, so I don't know that. So y'all can see the difference. Down down in Texas, I filled up um, the tank completely from empty. And it came out to $209 um, without death. Um, here it comes out to like 180 and I only filled up half of the tank of the tractor and the full reefer so if I would have filled the full reefer I would have spent like 230 240 dollars so I saved myself 40 dollars um, back there but here the further up you go the more expensive it gets so um, like I said we're about to take off I did look yesterday for um, alternate routes because uh, the tolls are mad expensive I gotta take if I take the GPS road it's gonna be three tolls in uh, Maryland on the I-95 and it's $48 each so I'm definitely gonna go around those that's $150 in tolls <laughs> I'm not I'm or excuse me $144 I'm not I'm not gonna pay that so I'm just gonna go around them um, and it's like an additional 30 minute drive so it's definitely worth it um, and it should be getting there tomorrow morning I'll still have a little bit of time left but it is what it is so um, I'll catch y'all when I get there or I'll probably get back with y'all after 30 minute break and then um, um, I'll see y'all then like I said, I got a call later as well to find out if they'll take this load tomorrow because um, it's not scheduled till Wednesday, uh, midnight, um, zero hour. So um, I don't feel like waiting the whole day Tuesday just to get unloaded. So if they can unload me early in the morning, I prefer to do that. So I'll let y'all know as soon as I find out and I'll catch you that on in, like, in a little bit. What's going on guys? So we are in New Jersey. We already delivered, uh, dropped off, or excuse me. Um, yeah, we got unloaded and came to this TA, just waited. I filled up because this is the cheapest one and I think they're gonna keep me in this area so I need to make sure I get it on the cheapest one. Um, we got a load, that's a FedEx load. Um, and we're gonna go pick it up because the receiver is a 24 seven uh, um, unload. So we're just gonna go see if though they have it ready if they have it ready i'm picking it up and taking it today so that's another quick little money that we can make on one day um and then tomorrow pick up another load and keep rolling but um this will be it for this episode um i'll get with y'all on the next load uh, but like i said it was a pretty smooth load nothing wrong we avoided all the tolls everything was good so i will catch y'all next time until then peace